Next scary item. <laughs> That's actually quite an improvement. <laughs> right, Joe. What's he want? He wants to ride Draco. Tell Tim. Tell Tim you want to ride Draco. You can ride him out in the riding area. Right Seriously, it's okay, Dalton. You mean you could try? You could try it. It's Draco needs riding anyway. I love your audience. Right. You see you see to your right. Yeah. What a improvement, man. Now you got chickens joining in over there. I know. Said. That's what I was just thinking. Well, then she stopped to think about it. She said, which one's scarier? Uh -huh. That's exactly what it is. Good girl. So yeah. I, that, that took a lot of processing there. I know. That's why I stopped for a minute just to let her kind of soak it in that it ain't coming off the fence. What is shaking the bag for? It's just something scary that's making noise that we're trying to teach her that, well, Dakota's trying to teach her that um, it's not gonna hurt her. Like not everything that is scary is gonna hurt you. You're just trying to get the horse used to something scary and that you can do stuff around her. So you find, you know, Anything and everything you can that's scary, and you show them that it's not really scary. It's just kind of in their head, and you kind of teach them that stuff is not scary. Good girl. So much better. She's had the bear on her before, yes. Yeah. I'm not going to make you stop. If you want to move, you can move. It's just going to follow you. Good girl. 
So basically, you take the scary item, and as long as she is scared of it, she's allowed to run and go. But if she doesn't run and go, then the item goes away quicker. And she's fairly calm now. 